Hello Church! Hello everyone who's watching us right now here at the official page of Lagro United Methodist Church Philippines. Welcome to our segment, Hymns from the Heart. Hello everyone! Yes, here we are going to feature church hymns and sacred songs with the heartwarming stories behind them and the inspiring stories of the men and women who wrote them. So that they may not remain as mere hymns we have learned to sing in church, but as hymns from the heart. This is Tito Arnel. And this is Levy. Join us in this segment. Hymns, hymns from, from the, the heart. heart. Our feature hymn for tonight is one of the most favorite Sunday school songs we have in our United Methodist hymnal. It is entitled, Tell Me the Stories of Jesus, which was written in 1885. The words of this hymn was written by William Henry Parker. William served as the superintendent of the Chelsea Street Baptist Sunday School and as church secretary for 35 years. It is said that he wrote an annual hymn for 30 of those years. He was a poet as well as a hymnist, and in 1882, at the age of 37, published a small volume of poetry titled The Princess Alice and Other Poems. This was likely dedicated to the real Princess Alice, daughter of Queen Victoria and Prince Albert, and it is said that a copy of the book was gratefully received by the Queen. Marami siyang isinulat na mga imno, especially for Sunday School anniversaries at labing lima dito ay naipublish sa Sunday School Hymnary noong 1905. The music of this hymn was composed by Frederick Arthur Challoner, was born in November of 1866 at Longton, Staffordshire, England. Noong mga panahon na yon sa England, Hindi lahat ng bata ay obligadong pumasok ng paaralan dahil tumutulong sila sa pamilyang maghanap buhay. Sa edad na sampu, si Frederick ay nagumpisa ng magtrabaho sa pagawaan ng bricks at makalipas ang dalawang taon ay nagtrabaho naman siya sa coal mine. At the age of 15, he started working at a pottery pero nagbago ang buhay niya na magmana ang pamilya niya ng isang piano. Naging masigasig matuto ng musika si Frederick. Nag-aral siya at nagpa-tutor sa isang co-worker niya kapag meal breaks nila sa factory. He took lessons whenever he could afford it and studied from books. While working full-time, he eventually passed the diploma examination and became an associate of the Royal College of Music. Hindi siya tumigil hanggang makuha niya ang kanyang bachelor's degree in 1897, at the age of 31. He continued, and by the time he earned his doctorate in 1903, he had composed and published over 400 works, including three cantatas. Now, gaya ng lagi nating tanong, paano naman nagawa ni Parker ang mga titik ng hymn na ito? Parker wrote this hymn in 1885, at the request of the children of his Sunday school class. Sabi nila, Teacher, tell us another story. The original six stanzas were printed on a hymn sheet. Naging very creative naman itong si Parker para sa mga pupils niya. Paano nga ba magandang ikwento ang story ni Jesus sa mga bata? Ang verses ng Tell Me the Stories of Jesus ay isinulat from a child's perspective, asking to hear stories such as when Jesus calmed the stormy sea of Galilee, or when he blessed the little children of Judea. So original poem, a third verse, describes the Savior's triumphal return to the temple in Jerusalem, and refers to palms and hosannas. The fifth verse included the Savior's teachings involving animals and nature, referring to sparrows and lilies. 
the sixth and final verse is dedicated to the atonement of Christ in the Garden of Gethsemane, although some have been excluded in later versions because of the heavy subject matter. This hymn first appeared among Methodists in the 1935 Methodist hymnal under the heading Hymns for Children. This is actually the challenge for us this Christian Education Month na may share natin lalo na sa mga bata ang pananampalatayang bumubuhay sa atin. And so, with no further ado, let us join our hearts together to sing our feature hymn for tonight, Tell Me the Stories of Jesus. Tell me the story of Jesus I love to hear Things I would ask Him to tell me If He were here Scenes by the wayside Tales of the sea Stories of Jesus Tell them to me First let me hear how the children Stood round his knee And I shall fancy his blessing Resting on me Words full of kindness Deeds full of grace All in the love light of Jesus' face Into the city I'd follow the children's band Waving a branch of the palm tree high in my hand One of his heralds Yes, I would sing Loudest hosannas Jesus is King Thank you for joining us tonight. This has been Tito Arnel and Levy here. And this is Hymns from the Heart, a production of the Communications and Web Ministry of Lagre United Methodist Church. <laughs> <laughs>